Hello, and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the old lady. Excuse my voice today. I don't know whether I'm coming down with something or what, but I'm a little phlegmy. So, uh, this is the episode 18 of The Rambler, titled Checks and Balances. Checks and Balances are uh, the the principle under which the American government is... is um, designed, or was designed, um, basically having seen the excesses that are available to an, a king whose parliament serves at his pleasure, um, they decided to make sure that the executive branch and the judicial branch and the legislative branch were equal co e were co-partners, um, so that, you know, any two of the three can overrule the other one effectively, and, and you know, within you know certain boundaries and and anyway it's it's complex but that's the principle um is that any given exercise of power could be checked by somebody else um what it has led to with the two party system that developed is gridlock um and these days it's very hard for the government to get anything done um but that's okay that's their problem not our problem Let's move on to the game where we are going to be playing Columbus Crew because they beat Montreal Impact. Um, we will be playing them away first and then home because they're the lower seeded team. We play them because we finished second and they finished the highest of the two teams that made it through the first round. So um, the seeding system is that is such that we will face them rather than Toronto, which is fine by me because Toronto are a tough, tough team. They may have finished down in sixth, but they are a tough, tough team. They've got Jovinko and Bradley and Altidore and so on, all still there. Um, they're, you know, I don't care that they didn't finish very well this year. They're a good team. And I'm, I did not want to play them as early as possible in the playoffs. I'd like to, you know, get at least one round through. Columbus have been very good uh, recently. They Well, I mean very good. They've been, they've been quite good. Um, as you can see, they haven't lost in six games, which is pretty darn good. And they've only lost twice in ten. Eleven. Is that eleven? I think it's eleven. Yes, it is. Um, twice in eleven games. So that's pretty darn good, I would call it. Um, so we're going to have to watch out for them. And they've got um, a nice variety of scorers, too, um, I notice here. I'll, they've got Kamara, they've got Van Mursel, they've got Santos and Meram. And if you keep looking up here, you'll find that the same people score again and again and again and again. So they are clearly capable of getting goals from all over the place. Um, how did they do in the league? Let's... Um, I'm going to see the league table, please. They scored 44 and conceded 43. And we scored 56 and conceded 53. So we are only slightly ahead of them on goal difference. Although we finished six points higher. Um, we should be able to outscore them. But they can also get some goals against us. So I think it very likely that there's going to be some goals in this. We'll see how it works out, but um, let's look at the lineup for a moment. We have Knighton at the back, Dielna's in because Tierney is suspended, Wellington and Antonio Farrell, Dawan behind Caldwell and Wynn, uh, Nemet and Egudelo beside Kamara, and actually I'm going to change that as I think about it. I'm going to bring in Coffee and swap him out with Caldwell. And I think I want him on defend rather than support. I know he's not quite as good at it, but I think that's a better place for him. Um, and rather than advanced playmaker, I know that's what he likes best. But I think I'm going roaming. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. He'll play what he needs to play. I'm going to let him play as, as he wants. Uh, Kamara's favorite setup is as an attacker. So as an attacking target man. So we'll let him play that. Um, yeah, 
on attacking I think actually I'm going to go counter on this one because they are a reasonably good team and they're they've been scoring fairly freely lately and we haven't so let's hope we can find the goals again and uh, Bushway doesn't start just because he's um, just got a little bit of a, a not a knock well he had a knock and so he's not quite as fit as I'd like him to be um, to start the game but he will be on the bench I'm pretty sure I left him on the bench I did good that's excellent expected to prove a point today uh, pick up where you left off last time out all right we got a few reactions there that's not too bad and let's see if we can do something in this game That was a nice chance. Let's see if we can make that happen again. Win. Whoa, and it's in! Win with win! We've got an away goal. I'm pleased. I will admit. That's a remarkable start. I'll take it. I don't care if we don't have possession as long as we're winning. This is very much a results-based situation. I don't care what the game looks like. I don't care whether it's pretty or not. What I care about is who wins at the end of the day. Nemet! Ooh! Good save, good save. Look at that, five shots, five on target. We're up for this one. Win, called well. Another try for his, one of his characteristic long shots, but not this time. Perilito, coffee, he also likes to take his long shots. And he's good at it. He scored a few this year from well outside the box. That's not good, but Knighton's got it. Good save. Not that he really tested them particularly strongly, but still a good save. I like that their center back is injured. I mean, I feel bad for him, but... But I can't say that I'm unhappy. Whoa! <laughs> that was an interesting place to kick that. I think if I were the ref, that might have gone down as dangerous play. We'll see. Whoa! They're not without chances, that's for sure. They're certainly growing into the game somewhat. Possession is theirs, but not as bad as I thought it might be. Ooh, we're going into halftime with a lead. And I think we're going to be not complacent. Yep. Oh, don't be stressed, Pirlito. I know you can do it. Do it. all the way back to the defense. Sorry, I got a little lost in thought there for a minute. Alasha Higuain. Santos. Oh, nice ball for Jimenez. 
This is not good. Knighton's got it. Good news is they're noticeably more tired than we are. They played three days ago. We played a week ago. Oh, I like this build-up play. This is good. Keep, keep finding people. Keep finding people. That's the way to do it. Agadello, no. Oh, I even jumped a little in my chair. They're just trying to head that in. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Everybody's playing well, at least. Oh, well, maybe Dielma's not, but he's playing at left back, and he doesn't really like to play at left back, so... He's really not a left back. He's a center back, but... What can you do? I'm going to have Bushway for, for Agudelo. And I'm going to keep Wynn fresh for next game. After that wonder goal earlier. Well, this is a very satisfactory start to our playoff days. Still satisfactory. We have an away goal. Anybody who needs replacement? Dielna not having a great game, and Farrell has been booked, so let's have Woodbury replace him. Uh, so Caldwell's now been booked. Alright, I can work with 1-1. One, one. That's quite reasonable. Oh, but 2 1 would have been much sweeter. Ah, that should be pretty much it. And tweet, tweet, tweet. There we go. Excellent. I would say you were excellent. I am happy with that performance, or you were unlucky today. No, I would say you were. Ha I'm happy with that performance. They did the job, especially. I mean, on the road, I'm I'm quite happy with that. They're on the road again, and I'm going to stop pushing, continue, and go over to OBS and make a little pause for you. I'll be back in a little bit. Hello and welcome back. It's time for the second leg. And, as you can see, we have made significant changes, at least some changes. Knighton, Dielna is going to stay in, Wellington, Antonio Farrell, Caldwell behind Rowe and Wynn. That's a big difference. Rowe is, uh, has been starting on the bench mostly. Nemet will stay, actually I'm going to bring Nyasi on the left. Sorry, I missed that one. Uh, I want Nyasi. There he is. Where's Nyasi? Thank you. And Bushway is coming on the right. Kamara stays up front because why not? He got the goal last time. We're going to try and go on control and see where we go with that. Okay. A game with the cancelling out. Um, the tactical setups are virtually identical, the difference being his attacking midfielder to our defending midfielder, and basically everybody's matched up pretty neatly. There's no overages or, or anything unusual out there. How about don't get complacent? Got some gain focus, that's good to see. We like gain focus, especially in the defense.
Oh, well done. And again. And again. Oh. But then a giveaway. Oh, you guys are supposed to be on deep. What was that, guys? Oh, that's terrible. Ugh. Bunch of good plays in a row, and then we give it away, and and they just go straight up Route 1. Lump it over the top and wait for Kamara to run onto it. Unbelievable. And we've got two shots on net. What the hell are my team doing? We now need three goals to win this match. Let this be one of them. Yes. As he caught the goalkeeper doing jumping jacks. Don't know why, but he was. Maybe he was just bored. Way. Yes! Nyasi with the goal to level the tie on the day. Now we need one more to make it into the to make it through to the next round. It's only the first half, but I really love to be back in control before the end of the half. Kamara, yes! And we've done exactly that. Now, should I drop back to counter? We did well on counter away from home. Said there'd be goals in this tie, didn't I? Okay, you know what? We're going to dance with the one what brung us. Attacking has given us this lead. Attacking is where we'll stay. Until it gets late in the game, maybe. Look at those three goals. Bang, bang, bang. I didn't notice how quickly we'd gotten them. All right, team talk. Don't let that happen. Okay, Kamara was confused and demotivated. Wonder if I can happy him up. I have faith in you. Nope, still confused and demotivated. Okay. That's not ideal, but what can you do? Oh, come on, boys. Just hold on to this one. And we'll have it. 
He's off tackles, Antonio. I should look at the tactics and check out whether I need to sub anybody. Caldwell, good man. Finds Kamara. Gets closed down because he always takes an age to turn on the ball. I don't know why he takes so long to turn. Win Lee with a great tackle. Gets it forward for Kamara. Got space this time. Runs through his man, literally. And Nyasi with the goal. What a flying header that was. Oh my goodness, we're actually going to have a shot at winning this. That's kind of fun. Anybody having a really bad game that I can replace? Not a bad game, but he's got a yellow card. And I think maybe that would be a better arrangement. There you go. Or maybe not. No, it's slightly better that way. Kellen Rowe can come off for Da Juan or no coffee. That'll do for now. Confirm the sub. Let's play. Oh, I'm nervous, I gotta admit. Columbus can score. They've shown this before. Oh, do 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 I think we've got it. I think we've got it. I think we're making it to the conference final. We are! Hooray! Hooray, hooray, hooray! You can't think of anything particular to say after we win 4-2 in the playoffs. I'm going to say you played very well, but don't get complacent. Don't get all confused and demotivated, you dummies. Yes, I saw that you played very well. You played very well. Now he's just confused. Well, that's good. At least he's not no longer mo demotivated as well. Let's see. You impressed me out there. He's just confused. Well, that's good. Passionate. Fired up. All right, we've... We've repaired most of that. Now nah, he's just confused. Okay, well, at least we got rid of the demotivated anyway. That's good. All right, I guess we're going to leave it there and and see who to who we get in the final, or should we find that out first? No, that's not till Tuesday, so let's leave that. We'll find out in Tuesday's game, or in Tuesday's match, Tuesday and, Wed Tuesday and Wednesday? Oh, they're, they're playing a week apart, okay. Well, it's going to take a while before we find out what um, what's going on in the Toronto-New York game. Why didn't they play them at the same time? That's really crazy. Anyway, so... We're going to be we're going to be playing home games in mid December in New England. This is going to be an interesting setup. But um let's let's see how that goes. I think that's everything we need from here. Okay. Let's do this thing with the thing and the yeah, hooray. So, I need to say all those things I say at the end of a video, like thank you very much for watching. I appreciate your time. 
I hope you won't mind leaving a like because I think that was a pretty good win. And maybe drop a comment if you think we're do you think we're going to be able to get to the final? To the final final, not the conference final. Um, this is effectively a semi-final because the conference finals just feed into the final final, which is, I don't know what they call it, the playoff final, the cup final, or something, I don't know. But um, anyway, follow me on Twitter, support me on Patreon, do those things if they're your thing. That's a lot of things to think about, those things. All right, I'm getting silly now. I will talk to you later. I hope you have a great day, and take care.